Today we are going to make cold meat. You can use any meat, any type, any anything. What does that mean? You can use pork, you can use chicken, you can use turkey, you can use duck. Not the duck. Yes, duck. You can use beef. You name it, you can use it. With that, let's get into it. We are using a normal piece of beef. We're going to add in some Dijon mustard. The Dijon is going to give it the flavor and the texture and the additional crunch from the mustard seeds. We're then going to be putting in additional amounts of spices. Because we are cooking it and then we're going to keep it cold, you use additional spices to enhance the, the flavors that is needed. The spices that we're using, it is Italian herbs. It gives it the herb natural taste to enhance the meat. We're going to be using crushed garlic and topping it off is going to be some barbecue spice. This is smelling amazing. Look at the color, the texture. It is perfectly, perfectly done. Share, like, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you don't get to miss out on another one of these uh, videos. We are going to cut it up into using a slicer. It is gonna be cut super thin. Look how beautiful these pieces are looking. It is just looking absolutely incredible. Look at that. That meat looks beautiful. Wow. Look at this. Building a sandwich, taking in the mustard, getting some lettuce, putting in some pieces of tomato. Let's get all of this beautiful looking meat onto the sandwich. As a sandwich goes, how gorgeous does this sandwich look? Look at that. That meat looks beautiful. Wow. Here we go, guys. Let's take a dive into this and see how this tastes. Mmm. The taste, the herbs, the crushed black pepper. Everything just works amazingly. Although that you saw it was heavily overspiced when we were cooking it, when you're adding it into a sandwich, you lose that overspicing and it just really works so well. This is incredible. Mm. Wow. Homemade cold meat. Super easy, super simple. Give this a go. Wow, this is just magnificent. And guys, on that note, catch you guys on the next one.